So what is your impression of Estonia now? Ah, no, you know the country is, is, is a nice country, otherwise I would leave this country. Yeah? Uh, but uh, the government does not know what they are, what they are doing. Look in, the, in this town. Huh? No uh, tourists come anymore. I was in, in uh, November in Berlin. Everything, the beer is half price in Berlin. Uh, uh, and the food, you everywhere can get food. No rest, not like restaurant. Here you must go in restaurant. Huh? You cannot go at the street side and say, oh, I want to eat a dinner or a bratwurst or something like that. No, 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 no. You must go in a uh, in an, uh, restaurant and go and look for a bench for resting in the town. Go and have a look if you find some. It's not... So it's uh, uh, against tourism. This, I, I would tell Savis, I should on a... On a, on a weekend, take his wife and her arm and go through this town and have a look what's going on in this town. And they all hear these idiots of the harbor, they say, ah, oh, every year we get more and more tourists. Every, I'm every day in town and less and less tourists or people I see. Where are they? Can you tell me? Maybe they are shopping. <laughs> uh, I, I, I don't think so, because uh, the shops are quite empty if you go there. Yeah. I go every day on, uh, over the market and through Stockman and Kaubermeyer and all these uh, here, Rimi or this shop over there. Uh, and the big time of these shops is over. As long as the, the, the cruise from, from uh, Finland here is so expensive, before, years before, uh, the Finn came over here for a weekend, hotel was much cheaper, so they could buy and they were buying everything here, you know. And, uh, and, and uh, after uh, two days being here, they have eating and, and, and shopping and everything, they could go home. Now they don't even come because it's too expensive. And this is what, I think this is what the government should do first. But. Uh, I think it's better for them to put uh, a monument from one place to the other. Maybe they find another monument, maybe they have some more, uh, so they can uh, also change them, mm -hmm. they have something to do. And uh, now it's, it's not quite serious what they are doing, mm -hmm. but it's so. And, uh, the Estonians elected them, huh? so yeah. they must now uh, get ready for them. But what do you think about the Estonian economy? How how is it possible to revive the economy, or what should oh, be done? Very easy. They, very easy. Tell me, what is this country producing for exporting? Turf. Oh, okay. Okay, yeah, yeah, that's the only thing, I think. So, uh, you only can uh, uh, get money in your cashier if you produce things and can sell them to anybody or to somebody, not to your own people. If I sell to you and you sell to me and I sell to you again, we cannot make money. It's, it's just changing. They must produce something what they can change in Europe or I don't know where in the world. This is what they must do. And but this is not so important, I think. It's, I think it's... Uh, they don't even think about it. And uh, like companies, a lot of companies already left Estonia. Estonians don't hear about that. And, uh, you know, companies like uh, we, who want to uh, make working places, they don't even speak with us. Mm. No, what for? And this is in, 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 in Germany. If I say I make 500 working places, Angela Merkel will call me and, and kiss my feet, you know. Yes. Yeah, really. And here? Here? No, nah, here they don't want. No, they say no. We don't. The, here in Paldiski, uh, uh, the, the uh, main guy of the, nah, of the uh, city council, uh, Jan uh, Mölder, told me personally, we don't need working places, we have really? enough. 
the, I said, ah, but this is the only town in the whole world who has enough working places. Yeah. I, I think, what, what, he's an idiot, not more. Yeah. Huh? And if, if the government has more of these people, it looks like it is. So I don't understand that. And as long as they are not interested in getting uh, producers here, it will not change. I'm very sure. And so they must. Oh, they must see this is this uh, uh, um, economy is not the problem of a world crisis. This is a very good excuse for the government, yeah, because this economy uh, make a crisis is a Estonian made. You think so? And yeah, no, it's very sure. Yeah. And the world crisis is very good for them. Yeah, you because then they can, it yeah, the they can crisis. say, no, 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 look, all, all have their trouble. No, no. Yeah. This trouble, Estonia, the Estonian trouble is a trouble of Estonia, not of the world crisis. Mm. If I don't export, I don't have any, any uh, connection to the world crisis. Yeah. That's true. So, yeah. And you are not planning to leave still? Uh, if the government will not be more unfriendly to me, I will stay here, that's right. But if they are uh, more unfriendly, I go. Mm. Because other, uh, other uh, countries, as I just told you, Poland and, and uh, uh, Latvia, they said, yeah, you can come immediately to us. They speak with us, not in Estonia, nobody. And we wrote to, to uh, Bartz, a letter to introduce this project and we wrote uh, to Savila, not even the watchman of the parking place did answer us. Nobody. Mm. So, they are not interested. But why did you choose Estonia? It's a stupid idea of mine. <laughs> no, because I... I because of Estonian women? Or no. No. Uh, it was... Uh, I was all over the world and mostly only in the south of this world, in Africa and Asia and everywhere, and never in the north. And I come from the, I, as I told you, from the ministry, and I said, I need to go to the north. And Estonia had a very good image in West Europe, very good. Mm -hmm. Not anymore, because they destroyed it themselves. Yeah, uh, and also I said, oh, that must be a good country, I go there and we can make our project there because a uh, uh, good country, we go there. So I went here and I could tell my prime minister uh, that it will be good when I go here and he said, yeah, you are right. He knew me because I made several projects in Africa. Uh, where he was connected also, so he knew me, and he said, ah, you can go there. Ah, we, I know you, you, you can make it. And this was the reason I chose uh, Estonia. And I had uh, several connections to uh, medical personnel, to doctors and so on and so on, through my ministry. Mm -hmm. And they have been in, in Germany for several times. And one day they asked me, oh, you can come to Estonia. I said, no, I cannot because I'm I'm administration uh, uh, officer. I cannot say I, I go there or I, I go there. Uh, but later on, I found uh, I should leave because I was long enough in this. I was 12 years in this ministry, so long time. So you must do other things. And this is the reason. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much.